You're watching NBC7 News at 4. Well, thousands of students are having or getting ready for their first day of school here in San Diego. For many, that means they need a visit to the dentist first. NBC7's Joe Little spoke with one dentist about taking your children to an appointment during the pandemic. Now you're going to have a seat right here, okay? Right Little Noah can't wait to get to kindergarten. However, he didn't really know he needed to go to the dentist first. Surprise! Easy, right? The five-year-old is one of thousands of students who need to open up and say ah before stepping foot into a classroom this year. <laughs> the state of California requires these exams for every new student. Dental health impacts a child's education in profound ways. Dr. Kami Ha says dental problems force kids to miss 51 million hours of school every day throughout California. And if they're in school, Dr. Ha says they don't perform well. If you have a toothache, can you sleep? It's very difficult to sleep. So, and when kids don't sleep, it interferes with their alertness. Good job. Dr. Haas owns and operates six super dentists around San Diego County. He says he understands why his patients disappeared when the pandemic started. The first few weeks was really so scary. Is it safe for kids? Is it safe for adults? The fact is dental offices have been open since last May and we've had almost no evidence of transmission of COVID between any patient and any dental office across the country. Good for you, you see? Haas says parents also shouldn't fear taking their kids to the dentist. He says they're taking all the precautions to keep everyone safe. And we've been wearing masks for 20, 30 years. This was never an issue before, right? Take this off and then you're going to go up. Being tough at the dentist with Noah. Okay, I'm done. Joe Little, NBC7. <laughs> you kid. That was a classic, wasn't it? Dr. Haas adds dental problems will only get worse and more expensive the longer people wait to get them fixed. Well.